Alrighty, well, good evening, everybody, and, well, I, um, just did a, did a sort of kind of random library search on the Steam page, um, or excuse me, on my Steam page, and, uh, this game came up. Um, it's called Creatures of Aether. It's a, kind of a card game based version of, uh, one of my favorite fighting games, Rivals of Aether. Um, never knew they had this out. So, I'm, I'm kind of part way into the tutorial, but, um, if anyone's ever played Final Fantasy XIV, I think they had a, oh god, I wish I, wish I knew, the, I wish I knew the name of the mini game. Um, you can play it at the Gold Saucer, and, uh, you, ha you also have to go to various places throughout the world to get various other cards as well. Triple Triad, that's what it's called. But yeah, this game, it uh, plays a lot like Triple Triad, but with uh, Arrivals of Aether flavor to it. So, But anyway, I got partway into the tutorial, and I'm like, you know what? Since uh, since I didn't really do a whole lot on my pinball stream, I figured, eh, might as well, give the, might as well go ahead and uh, document this. So, But like I said, kind of a, kind of a recap. Um, this is a card version of one of my favorite fighting games, Rivals of Aether. So, so this is kind of a, kind of an in-progress session. Um, well, for, for right now, the music, not, not that great. It's pretty repetitious. Uh, but I'm waiting on a copyright check on, um, one of my, um, uh, one of my YouTube albums that, um, that I downloaded. I gotta make sure it's, like, free to use and all that. Um, when it comes back, and if it is free to use... I'm going to go ahead and switch over to that instead. For right now, I'll just do that. <clears throat> okay, so... Um, I don't think you can. Okay, you can. I was trying to, I was trying to rewind back. But uh, the basics of this game is, if you go look at this, the card in the middle here, the numbers in the upper left corner. Um, your goal is to capture other cards by uh, by having a greater number than theirs. It than theirs. They'll probably show you more than one card. I can show you. So, so, like, for example, if I want to place a card to the right of him, my power, his uh, number has to be at least three or more. If I want to put a, if I want to put a card underneath him, that the top number has to be at least five or more. So kind of, the, kind of the same thing here. If I wanted to put a card to the left of this guy, the card I laid down has to have a minimum, a minimum power level of two. So, but like I said, this this works just like Triple Triad in Final Fantasy XIV. It was uh back when I played Final, back when I played that game consistently. Um, it was actually one of my favorite mini games, the Triple Triad. So I'm gonna I'm gonna take a drink of some Arizona green tea. Hold on. And then, what they're, what, I can't remember her name. She's, a the element of air. She's a goat creature. Um, and I'm talking about rivals of Aether, by the way. But yeah, what she means by elemental tiles, like, it typically looks pretty obvious, but a fire tile, putting a fire tile on there gets you plus one. The color of the tiles, like this guy's red. So, he gets fire creature, uh, fire elemental, will get a plus one. So, that should be four. So, and then, same thing here. Oh, okay. Okay, I see, I see. The element's on the uh, lower right corner. All right. So, put him on an earth tile, he gets plus one, three, two. He's going to capture them both.
it's so far from what I've seen in this tutorial, it's kind of like that of uh, League of Legends for the super brief period of time I played it. it. It almost insults your intelligence. Click the icon. Well done! Look, oh, okay, thanks. Um, wasn't that hard. I mean, just click and drag something from point A to point B. Okay, I'm gonna hold off just a moment. Okay, so the copyright check on my album is almost done. So, hopefully I should be getting a yay or nay here real quick. Okay, it's so, okay. I kinda got stonewalled, so, I mean. starting to agree. Green creature I can't remember the name of. She's, uh... In Rivals of Aether, she's a squirrel. Um, element is Earth. She can, um... Uh, I think she uses a whip, but anyway. Yeah, I kind of agree with her, but then again, I played this before, so... Maple, that's her name. So, okay, so there's kind of a, there's, I guess there's a sort of kind of time limit on this. Again, the, the goal, the goal is to, to capture cards by uh, hitting them with a power level higher than their own, so. Just so that's air. And, um, uh, and I, and ideally, uh, the power, the uh, power level, of the card you lay down, should be just barely enough to beat them. Like if the, her, um, her right side uh, power level is one, you don't, you don't throw a, you don't throw a seven, you don't throw a seven down there. That's overkill. So, but like I said. You want to you want to capture cards, basically with a power level of no more than one point higher. So, okay, I'm gonna. Okay, so the copyright check came back, and it looks like we're good to go. Um, so, so let me do some uh, let me do some sort of cleaning up here. Go ahead and kill that. Is that all there is on here? Just audio settings? Because I'd also kind of like to take this game on a full screen, too. Yeah. Apparently, that's it. Just audio settings. Okay, so, like I said, since the, um, since the, mu 
since the uh, album I was doing the copyright check on came, it came back clean, I'm going to go ahead and throw this on instead. Um, this is Empyrean Frost, a uh, Dreamweaver. Now, from what little I heard of it, it's kind of okay. Um, nothing that really jumped out and grabbed me or anything, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and go with this. Oh, and I also forgot to mention, too, um, Order of the Black Arts. This is uh, one of my favorite channels. They, they, um, they'll, put, they'll uh, post up a lot of dungeon synths and ambient music and stuff like that. Um, and oftentimes, uh, especially on Sundays, they do this in bunches. Like, they won't just put out, like, one album at a time right when it comes out. They'll uh, save up a whole bunch of albums, and then usually on Sundays, they'll just release them all at once. So, this is just uh, one of many that I've downloaded and checked out and stuff. So, I'm like, so just going to go with this one. Um, just, I don't really feel like digging up any of the others. It's just because I have this one right here ready to go. And um, if if anybody finds any finds this music kind of off-putting, I'm sorry, but um, I mean I'm not playing this to piss people off. But like I said, towards the start of this video, the in-game music is pretty repetitious. You just really get a grade on me after a while. Then I am gonna have to do a bit of a cop or I'm gonna have to do a bit of a sound tech sound check on this. Uh, seems English is my second language right now. Oh here's since I don't wanna wait. I'll, I'll turn it down a tiny bit. So let me go ahead and rewind it back to the beginning. And then, um, I'll come back and I'll check the sound from time to time. But yeah, I kind of want to get back going on this. So. And then. So, yeah, fire. Um, uh, yeah, it's going to have to be that one. It should be four. So, can't grab that one. Can't gra grab that one. And in fact, my four beats are two, so, so she's mine. And, um, and it's been a very long time since I played Triple Triad, you know, and again, Final Fantasy XIV, but as far as I know, you only, only one number needs to be, um, or only, only one number matters, like 10 beats of five, so that's all I need to capture this card. You know, my four beats of two, and that's all I need to capture this card. Like, I don't have to... I don't have to beat all four numbers or anything. So. So that should do it. kind of reeks of microtransactions.
Yep. Triple Triad had this as well. Um, certain, um, certain NPCs that you go up against will have, uh, unique rules and stuff. I'm a water guy, so... So what I'm going to go ahead and do, not really comfortable having my uh, e email and password and all that stuff out in the open. I'll just go ahead and I'll throw that up. That's the music that's playing right now. Here. go come on guys it's 2022 uh little archaic with the username system nope no special characters are allowed like i said this is 2022 we should be able to type out our names you know spaces any special any special characters everything or at the very least i mean how archaic does the system have to be where you can't have spaces in your names? I'm sorry to be, you know, sorry to be nitpicky, but you know, back in the '90s and 2000s, I probably would have understood it. I mean, it was practically the internet stone age back then. But like I said, 2022 spaces ought to be allowed. Yes, I have to restart the game. That's kind of screwy. I still want to take this game out of pull screen. I want it to be windowed. Or, failing that, um, full, sc uh, full screen windowed. Not enough cards in the deck. Okay, well, okay, there we go, windowed mode. All right, perfect. Once again, sorry to sound like a broken record, but it's 2022. I mean, these days we ought to be able to have, being able to, ca you know, use capitalization and spaces in your names. I mean, again, probably like back in the 90s and stuff, you know, when the uh, internet was still fairly new, I, act I understood this. So I'm going to, I'm going to take another drink of some Arizona green tea here. Hold on.
Okay, so... So, is there a... So you can have up to 20 cards, so I'm just gonna go ahead and go. Not a, I don't get it. Oh, power level. I thought this is up. I thought this is up. How many, the amount of cards in here you can have in your deck. So. So I'll go with that. Too sure on this one. <sighs> yeah, this can be tough to set up. Sure, on this one. Um, <laughs> bring 
bringing out the big gun. Okay, I guess I won that one. Yeah, I don't get anything. So. So, let me go ahead and, um. Let me go ahead and do a battle, and then after this, I'll probably end up calling it good. <laughs> Little Timmy. Oh, we got a 4x4. Four four. I'm a weak spot. I don't know what that does. Yeah, so much for that. Deal with that is. Oh, okay. So you can do some card swapping. Perfect spot for him. bit weak on the right side. Okay, so, um, so that's gonna do it for me, everybody. Um, like I said, I just wanted to do a little, a little quick run of this thing. Um, and the way it's playing right now, there's a chance I might actually stream this. So, but again, we'll, uh, we'll see you come later on. Um, but th yeah, this is some, this is something I'd like to play more of in the future. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna take another drink here. Hold on.
So yeah, but um, I like what I see. So I said more in the future. I gotta look at something. Not a not a fan of the black border lights around this game. So, but anyway, um, thanks for drop for <clears throat> thanks for watching everybody. I appreciate that, and I'll see you all next time. Bye for now.